What's up, YouTube? This is Ashton Reef again, part three of the DIY Skimmer. Now, as you can see, I'm putting pieces together. Ooh, shiny. And this bad boy's big. Big, big, big. Well, not too big. Total height is around two feet from top to bottom. It's not too bad. Now, I'm just waiting for some pieces to dry here. This valve. Open closing allows me to control the height of the water inside here. So we slow this down, allow the pump to pump the water in quicker, then it can come out here. Pretty basic, very easy. Then that way the water in here can raise, and then you can get your foam line closer to this part, or further away, whichever you need to tune the skimmer. That's the way to tune these, pretty easy. You can also tune them with the water or the bubble lines as well. There's a lot of tuning to probably one of the DI ones versus the ones that you purchase, but this cost 50 bucks. I think I paid 50 bucks for everything with a pump. And if I bought one of these, 250, 300. So I'm saving money. Anyway, we'll update you guys, let you know how it works. We'll have one of uh, it running as well. Let's just see the catch cup here. Basic. Really basic, actually. Really easy, easy to build. Simple. Well, until next time, peace. Ashton Reef.